The BMPT-72 is a Russian armored vehicle. It is nicknamed the Terminator 2. It was developed by Ural Vagonzavod as a private venture. It is a further development of the BMPT. The new vehicle is based on comprehensively upgraded T-72 main battle tank. Also it is fitted with new turret and has reduced crew. It was first revealed in 2013. The BMPT-72 is being proposed for the Russian army and export customers. In 2017 this vehicle is designed to support tank operations, primarily in urban areas. Its main role is to engage enemy infantry. It is worth noting that main battle tanks are vulnerable to guerrilla warfare tactics. Also this tank support vehicle can engage other targets such as armored vehicles, main battle tanks and low-flying helicopters. So the BMPT-72 can act as a force multiplier and significantly increase efficiency of tank units. The aging T-72 MBT is still widely used around the world. A number of countries also still operate large fleets of these tanks or keep them in storage. However this tank cannot match modern MBTs in terms of protection, firepower and mobility. Ural Vagonzavod proposes to convert existing tanks into capable BMPT-72 combat vehicles. The BMPT turret can be also integrated on the hull of the T-55 and other older Soviet tanks. Original turret of the T-72 has been replaced. The new unmanned turret of the BMPT-72 with has lower profile. This vehicle packs a formidable punch. All armament is mounted externally. It is armed with two 30mm cannons. Thesis cannons are dual-fed and fire a wide range of ammunition including high-explosive fragmentation, HFRAG, rounds, anti-personnel ammunition, APRST, high-explosive tracer, HID, rounds, high-explosive fragmentation incendiary, HFI, rounds, armor-piercing tracer, APD, rounds, or armor-piercing discarding sabo, APDS, rounds and kinetic energy, K, rounds. Also there is a coaxial 7. 62mm machine gun. There are four Atikati anti-tank missile launchers. The Atikati missiles can be fitted with tandem heat, HFRAG, or thermobaric warheads. These missiles have a maximum range of 5 km launchers are shielded from small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. The BMPT-72 lacks two 30mm automatic grenade launchers that are present on the previous vehicle. It allowed to reduce vehicle crew from 5 to 3 men. The new vehicle is operated by commander, gunner, and driver. The tank support combat vehicle has the same level of protection as modern main battle tanks. Vehicle has integrated explosive reactive armor panels. Damaged modules can be easily replaced in field condition. Rear end of the hull and turret is covered with cage armor to increase protection against RPG rounds. Turret of the BMPT-72 is better protected than the original turret of the BMPT. Interior is fitted with Kevlar lining which protects against spalling. Vehicle also has NBC protection and automatic fire suppression systems. The BMPT-72 has a new fire control system with day-slash-night capability. It is superior to that, used on the original BMPT. Vehicle has a commander's panoramic sight. The new tank support combat vehicle uses refurbished chassis of the T-72 main battle tank. Currently, two engines are being proposed for this vehicle. It can be powered by a V-84 MS multi-fuel diesel, developing 840 horsepower. It is a standard engine of the T-90 main battle tank. The second option is a new V-92 S2 multi-fuel diesel, developing 1,000 horsepower maximum range with external fuel tanks is 500 kilometers. A vehicle is also fitted with auxiliary power unit, which powers all systems, when the main engine is turned off. Vehicle has a built-in self-entrenching blade and can be equipped with a mine plow. With short preparation, the BMPT-72 fords water obstacles up to 1.8 m deep. It can be also fitted with a deep wading kit and fort obstacles up to 5 m deep. 